What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority. What are we gonna do, Daniel? Today we're gonna open up wine bottles without a wine bottle opener. Let's check this out. For this one, we're gonna use a knife to open it. Let's check out how. What you wanna do is grab a knife and push it si sideways like this. So don't go straight down. Yep. And then you're gonna twist it and up. Twist it oh, and up. Oh, wow. Twist it and up. All right, after you twist it a bunch of time, pulled out. Look, now you can actually use your fingers to pull it out. Boom. Nice. Whoa. That's so cool, dude. For this life hack, we're going to open a wine bottle using a screw. Put the screw in the middle and just start twisting it, getting it down into the cork. If you can't use your fingers, just go ahead and get an actual Phillips head, Phillips head screwdriver. If you don't have a screwdriver and it hurts your fingers, just get a paper towel or a smaller screw and just twist the bottle. Hold on to the screw. It'll screw itself into the cork. So now take your fork, slide it underneath the head of the screw, and you're just going to use leverage. Pop it up. And then once you get it started out, there wow. you go, baby. Easy. That's so awesome. For this life hack, we're gonna open a bottle of wine with a torch. All you have to do is just uh, heat it up over here, but don't overheat If it doesn't open, don't do it. But it should pop open really easily. Whoa! Whoa! It's like it a rocket. Wow, that's awesome. I would say if you don't want to ruin the wine at all, you just let it sit out. Oh yeah, that's true. And then let's let it cool down on its own. I have a good idea. Just go buy it and just open a bunch up. Pop, 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 and then let them cool down. Yeah. This life hack is going to require some safety glasses, a bottle of wine, and an air compressor hose. Take your air compressor, stick this bad boy right down the middle of your cork. Be careful, don't break it. There you go. <laughs> Man. Did it hurt your hand? No. That's awesome. It popped right out. Wow. The pressure in the bottle, the air pushes the cork right out. Science. Let's go drink. <laughs> For this part, we're gonna use two nails and a hammer. Everybody got hammers and nails. So what you wanna do is get it like that from the angle and another one from the angle as well. Something like that. And then you grab a hammer and pull it out with a cork like that. Nice. Boom. Easy. Wow. Pretty cool, huh? Is this how Russians do it in Russia? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, like a man. <laughs> For this life hack, we're going to open up a bottle of wine by using scissors. Check it out. Take your scissor and just put it inside the hole, the cork, all the way down. Deeper. The scissors through the entire cork, I can see it through the bottle of wine, and then I hold the bottle, twist the bottle, and pull up with the scissors, and it comes out easy peasy. I like how you use this other piece of handle to twist it. It's yeah. awesome. Ta -da. For this life hack, we're gonna open a bottle of wine with a key. Let's check this out. What you wanna do is grab the key, jam it in, jam it out. What you wanna do is jam it in sideways. Just like this. All the way in if you can. And then you just gotta twist it. Get the twist. Once you twist it, it's gonna be all done. Boom. Once it's twisted, Nice, easy. dude, that's super easy. Wow. Everybody's Easier got than a knife, huh? Then you can open a bottle of wine anywhere then. If you have yep. keys. If you got keys, really easy. So what I'm gonna do, I'll put a glove on just in case, and then grab the bottle, you see it's closed, and then stick it inside of a shoe, just like that. And just grab it like that by the shoe, and by the bottom and just stamp it on the side of a door so I do not break the, the wall and just stamp it.
As you can see, the bottle slowly pushing itself out. You see it? Let's do some more of that. Look how much it's already open. And I can almost already open it up, but I'm gonna stump some more till at least it's halfway out. So this is how I hold it. I put it in a shoe and then I go up with one finger over the bottle and a shoe. That's my grip. And the other one, right here. Don't stamp it too hard. You don't want to break the bottle in your hands. As you can see, it's opening more and more. And now I can just open it with my hand. As you can see, boom. And we open bottle of wine with the shoe. How crazy is that? All right, that's pretty much it. Let us know in the comments below which one was your favorite. Subscribe to Danny Sorody, how to punk it up. Links in the description. And thank you for watching. Peace. Make a hole right in the middle of it, just for the straw. So we're gonna put a straw inside of the hole. Get petroleum jelly and seal up all the holes around it. To do. Oh man, you see it's not... Whoa! Not hold on! It's, well, that's awesome! And once they're gonna try to grab a store... <laughs> oh man, what's going on? <laughs> Holy crap!